So today's lesson from Mark's Gospel, that um, very familiar, possibly infamous passage about divorce, which is echoed in Matthew's Gospel and a tiny bit in Luke's, uh, and then the idea of children coming to Jesus. In both cases, the men, I'm afraid, don't come off very well. Uh, in the first case, there's the idea of casual divorce and the serving of papers to your wife for the slimmest of reasons, which is what Matthew's uh, gospel message talks about. Mark doesn't have that in and just raises that Aunt Sally of what does the law say? Well, we knew what the law says. It's there in Deuteronomy 24. They knew that. Um, but there's a sense of, in both ideas of little children coming to Jesus being pushed away, Similarly, with in relationships, people being pushed away for the slimmest of reasons, it goes back to the heart of our Christian understanding. God's love is for all people. And that love, that concern, trumps everything else. And that whatever happens in society, in people's lives, or, or in their situations, always it is the love that God has for us, that we feel in our hearts, which trumps our response to others in need. Labels such as divorcee or, ch or child matter not a jot. We are interested in caring and loving for all because we ourselves know ourselves to be so blessed. And that is such a liberating thing and means there can be no place in our witness and in our outworkings of our faith for prejudice, for judgment, for division, because that's not how God treated us. We are treated equally and loved equally, and that's such an important message.